to get in the gym to with... rumble are you ready to get in the gym with face jazz for the personal coach yes or no When we were younger, everything was different. It was a time where risk taking meant sliding down the tall slide, where your imagination reached as far as the stories your mom would read out to you. It was a time where taking a leap of faith meant taking off the training wheels of your bike and trusting your ability to ride it without falling. But now, risk taking means understanding consequences and taking a leap of faith requires confidence. I wasn't really made for school or working a 9 to 5. I realized that I'd rather do something creative and have more freedom. So in 2015, with 11 bucks in my bank account, I took the biggest leap of faith in my life. I decided to quit school and create the life I've always wanted for myself. Now, dreams no longer meant bedtime and imagination didn't just come from bedtime stories. It was all real life. So with nothing but an idea, 11 bucks to play with and a shit ton of confidence, I just took the risk and allowed the unexpected to happen. Relax, dog. With your pretty little yeah, ass. Give me pre workout. Yo, I have to shit these today. And I'm gonna now get into the gym with you. Hi. I love you. Oh, you crazy. I like big boys. boys. We are at the gym. And I'm gonna be your personal trainer for today. Yeah, I'm scared as fuck. <laughs> you don't have to be. Okay, Vera. Squats first. We're in a squat rack. Ass to the grass, baby. Good form. Okay, Vera, come here, come, come to me. Okay, so. Squats is the first one. We're doing four sets with a set weight. Okay, so you pick a weight that you think you could do for four sets for 10 repetitions. But the fourth set, we're gonna do pulse squats. Pulse. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I'll, I'll show you. Three, three sets of 10. Yeah. I think that's too much. Ten? I haven't been here for like 10 years. Let's do 10. Okay. Okay? Alright, high five. So I'm gonna die. Yep. With your Number two. Lovely. Okay, let's see what you got. Nice dead. One. Two. How's it going so far? Well, it's kind of out of breath. Kind of good, right? Kind of good, but so out of breath. <laughs> <laughs> All right, one more set and then the pole squad. I will show you. Okay, so now. We did three sets of normal squats. Now we're gonna do pole squats, which are a great finisher, but they suck. So we get to the bar, 
in your neck, just like a regular squat. You go down, 90 degrees, and you pulse up to half, then you down again, and then up. And that's one rep. So, you pulse. Like that. And you're gonna go to failure. Help me. I love it. Yes, love it. Come on, you got this. Thought this was gonna be a fun workout. It wasn't. <laughs> because I'm not that fun. Nope. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> yes. Next exercise. It's gonna be in a dark place here. Yeah, it's mentally. So dark in here. <laughs> but we're doing leg press. Close stance. Yes. Okay, 10 reps. Feet straight, knees straight, and don't go anywhere. Yep. Going out. Not out, but. No, no, and going in, just going straight forward. Exactly. How much are you doing on it? I don't know. Like Why do I have 15? to be You're the personal trainer. True. I would say, let's start with 15. Alright, let's go. One. Two. Three. Nice. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Nice. Good? Yeah. Squeeze in the butt? Yeah. Good, good, good. Just have to understand this movement. Yeah. Come on, V. You got it. Squeeze. Yes. Oh. oh my god, I'm dead. Good, 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 good. Here. I got you some water. I am a bit dizzy. <laughs> you a bit dizzy? Yep. We're almost done. Hello. Welcome to Vera's vlog. Jasper is away, so I'm recording my own little vlog. I hope he doesn't notice. Alright, next up, you good looking you. Next stiff leg deadlift. Press. No, we're not. We're <laughs> doing stiff leg deadlift <laughs> for the hamstrings. All right. Yeah. Let me see how you do. Let me see how you. Three sets, twelve reps. Okay. Okay. Try to stiff them up a little bit. The legs. Let's go. No. So did you pass? Uh, one more. Okay. Yes, I didn't. I think you're doing quite well, but I think you can go a little less low to keep the tension on the hamstrings. Oh, and okay. to keep your back a little bit more straight. Okay. Because otherwise the, the, the final part you will do it. Like, like this, with the, with and then the, the lower back will yeah. come in. So we try to get it on the hamstring. So right. Get it stiff to here, get a stretch, and More then up. Isolating. Yes. More All isolating. Right. Okay, so our SD card is full, and I cannot really delete anything because there's also all the footage on it. So I'm gonna switch to the phone. Give me a sec. Okay. You ready? No. Let's go. So, more tension on oh, the <laughs> Okay, 
you roll the dice once. We just, we just found some dice here. Roll the dice. That times three is the amount of reps you have to do next set. Imagine so, it would be six. That would be 18 then. Just roll the dice. You dumb. I'm gonna do like a special effect trick. <laughs> it's two. It was, honestly, so it was six. almost one. Did you see it's one? Yeah, it was over? almost one. One. Two. Come on, more tension. Squeeze the glutes at the end. Yep. Where am I? Seven. Oh wait, I need to do six. Okay, 50 lunges. We're walking out of the head. Praying the whole time. I know. Like, praying to God. Please let me make this. Let me end this. Please. Please end the suffering.